Hi, I'm Becky Roseman, a wildlife biologist with the Mississippi Bat Working Group. Today I'm going to talk about evening bats, which is the species we capture the most while mist netting. Looking at this preserved evening bat, you can see that they are a medium-sized bat with a total length of approximately 3.7 inches and a wingspan of 10 to 11 inches. Their body mass is between 5 and 14 grams. The fur and wing membranes are both dark brown. One of the most unique characteristics about this species is their smell. They have a very distinct musky odor, sort of like old shoe leather. When we release evening bats, we always release them on a tree. They climb the tree using their thumbs and hind legs and then take off. Evening bats are found in eastern North America, south of Michigan and Pennsylvania. They are found across Mississippi, although we still have some counties in the state without records for evening bats. They are a forest dwelling species and roost in tree crevices, cavities, and behind loose bark. They will use bat houses and occasionally roost in buildings. Like many Mississippi bats, female evening bats form maternity colonies and adult males tend to roost alone. Maternity colonies may contain up to several hundred bats. Females give birth to two pups in late May or early June. Pups can usually fly by the time they are about 20 days old. They begin feeding on insects at about 24 days old and are nearly adult size by the time they are one month old. This bat house on Tallahatchie National Wildlife Refuge in Mississippi supports a colony of over 50 evening bats. The bats begin emerging to go feed at dusk. Watch the following video clip closely and try to count the bats dropping out of the box and taking flight. Seventeen bats came out during this clip, and you may have seen several others flying around the box. In the video clip, you probably heard the insect noise in the background. Evening bats are very important predators on insects, especially agricultural pests. They feed primarily on beetles, moths, and leafhoppers, including the spotted cucumber beetle, which is the adult form of the southern corn rootworm. I hope you enjoyed learning a little bit about evening bats. Check out some of our other species profiles on common Mississippi bats. 